What's good YouTube? This is your boy Third Rail Beats back with another video. Today I'm going to show you guys how to use Maximus Multiband Compressor to master your tracks. I've got an instrumental uh, loaded up and we're going to use that to master. So let's jump into it. I'm going to got my beat here. I'm going to link that to channel 5 and we're going to apply Maximus to this channel. Now if you have your music tracked out, you know, separated in different channels, you know, uh, kicks, snares, hi-hats, you want to apply this to the master track. But since mine is already in one WAV file, I'm going to apply that to this track. So let's take a listen to it and see the levels because as you can see, this is um, a low level recording. I did that on purpose. I reduced the volume to 50% so you can see the power of Maximus. Now you see it, it's only about here, about negative 15 dB. What we want to do is get it between 12 and negative 6 dB output. So we're going to apply a Maximus. I'm going to clear my presets so I can start from scratch. Okay. Now we're at zero. We got there's a few toggle switches we're going to manipulate. First, we're going to go to put RMS on. Just click that toggle switch. RMS is the true level of your sound. Now we're going for um, an output of 12 to negative 6 dB. So we're going to move this and this to 12. Just left click them and they'll change. Okay. First thing after that we're going to do is this solo button. You're going to enable that by left clicking. That's going to open up your bands meter. To, to get there, this little circle next to your monitor, you're going to click that and your bands will open up lows, mids, highs. Now what we're going to do is we're going to adjust our lows to the fundamental level of our snare. So we're going to play, click low and play the beat. We're going to move the low up a little bit. right about there. We're going to do the same thing for the highs. I don't want to hear that snare. I just want to hear the hi-hats. Great. Sounds good. Now the bands are set. Now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to come back to the master and we're going to be manipulating pre and post gain. Now this is a little confusing in Maximus so I'm going to clear it up. Pre gain is the sound coming into Maximus. Post gain is the sound going out of Maximus after it's compressed and after the limiters have been applied. Okay, so now we're going to apply the changes we just made to our bands and turn limit the compressions on. Now, there are three things when it comes to your master track. This graph represents controls. They are the threshold, the ratio, and the knee. This is the knee here. This is the threshold. This is the ratio. We can manipulate these to get the sound we want. We can also manipulate each individual frequency. All right. So I think it sounds pretty good. Let's 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 listen to it after those changes. Okay, I think the highs are a little too high um, and the volume 
is just at negative 12 we're going to push that up to negative 6 and see how we like that Okay, we're getting there. So you see how minutely I'm changing? Okay, sounds pretty good. And I was looking at my meter over here to see where it's at. It's about negative six. So now we're going to turn our bands button off. And we're going to come to these two lines and click that. That puts a graph here. And this is what we just played. Now there's two lines here, two different colors. This is the one in front. The lighter green is your pre-gain, the sound coming into Maximus. And the one behind it, the darker green, is the post-gain, what's coming out of Maximus after our compression and limiters have been set. You see how it's almost peaking at six. So we're going to turn that up a little bit, the post game, and see if we can get a little bit above six. I just turned this up just a tad. That's good. The steady lines here are about six peaking negative three we want to make sure that we don't um, go beyond zero so that's good once again this is the first part of a tutorial on mastering with maximus this is your boy third rail beats signing off please don't get forget to leave comments for the video please subscribe there's more videos coming keep banging out them rockers man